One Owner Car Guy, OneOwnerCarGuy.com. And what I've got here for you today is the interior video of this beautiful 2008 Lincoln Town Car. It's in great shape. I just had to check my phone because it's on a split month there, like six, where it could have been a 2009. I wasn't sure. Just wanted to make sure, tell you exactly what we're looking at. Absolutely beautiful car that I forgot that I had to do pictures of while I was up here too, started doing my video. I'm gonna do it once around, kind of show you the once around to where you can see just what a big long stretch limousine you are looking at. And then I'm gonna, I already did the up close and showed you everything outside and everything like that. And this will be an interior video showing the amenities, the options, and all that kind of stuff of the inside of this limo. So that's that. You can call me, Nathan, you can call me anything you want. Just call him, buy it. Nathan, it's 406 546 8748. Reach me anytime. And that's about that. Make sure to subscribe, like the video, comment, talk to me about it, something like that, you know. And that's about all I'm going to say. So I'll jump in, show you under the hood and stuff. I'm going to pop it, and then we'll start looking inside and get to moving. All right, I popped the hood, so here we go. And no, it doesn't just magically pop. Pop. I opened the door and did that. So here you go. Look at that motor. One of the most reliable, best running, awesome, long lasting power plants that's ever been made. This limo is a town car, man. It's a service body, it's a service engine. It was made to be the luxury cars and the police cars and the taxi cabs of the world. And they did a good job for a heck of a long time. This thing's so clean, it's even got all the stickers on everything still. Just awesome to see something in this good of shape. And these are going away, these are getting to be rare to find in this kind of shape. Even the hood insulation, hood padding is just in great shape. So as you can see, under the motor, beautiful. Under the motor? Yeah. Under the hood, just in great shape. And with that, I'm going to show you the inside and everything and try and get to a different area to where we can do it there. I might actually do the test drive first. I like that idea. I do. Just going to hop in it and we'll test drive it down there. I got some battery going out on my camera, so I'm trying to conserve. Actually, I'll show you the partition here. Hang on. There we go. So there's that. Pull that down. And of course, all your other windows work fine. I was putting them back up and trying to steer with one hand there. I'm sorry. So windows and all that are good. Yeah, buddy. It's got plenty of get up and go. There's actually a church over here I do some pictures at that I wanted to snap a few in this sunset type time to see just what we came up with. And I have test drove this in the other video. And I actually drove this um, to L uh, LA from Anaheim and then to San Diego from LA. And stinking drove great. You got a lot of car to get in a turn behind you. Don't forget that. Take your turns wide. But overall, it's a very easy car to drive, um, which is cool. And I think I'm gonna go back a different way. That'll help me get a better video. My time is just, my battery is dwindling, I guess you, that's what I'm trying to say here. There's just a little picture I wanted to get in this one, in this parking lot. At this time, other than that, we'll get back on the road and then I'll start getting to showing you the inside. Okay, well that accomplished what I wanted. Auto locking doors and such. And by the way, there's that window going down and up, and there's that one going down and up. So, you got that. You got that on your side, I'm telling you. So the external or interior options are all working. The extremities, the options, uh, whatever you want to call it. I can't get over how smooth it rides. Sometimes if you got a dually pickup, that thing will just tap, 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 down the road. 
and when you hit them, grooves in the road will rumble and throw you all over. And that's just in a crew cab dually pickup. This thing's got a lot more length to it, but it seems to be the length that just kind of smooths that ride out because it rides nice. And I'm going to turn here where we can get a little bit of 45.50 back on the back road. I don't know what else to say offhand. Um, everything pretty much goes through it. You got all kinds of controls here. Um, all your options are good. Nice. Your seats are beautiful. I've got my knot for hire and stickers here. These are just in great shape. Look at that. I'm gonna do this. We can go forward. We can go backward. Down the front. Wait. Up in the front. Now down to the front. Now up in the back. Now down the back. Now the back. Now up. So there's every way for you on that seat. I'll show you the one I'm on when we get out. Just figured might as well use my time prudently and wisely at the stoplight there. And we did that. So, we're just like Willie now. We are truly on the road again. Shifting, everything on this car is just nice. I don't know of anything that there is to actually fix on it. It's just mechanically sound. Seems to have been very well maintained. And shiny, nice, and beautiful as can be. I usually go the other way here. In fact, I just did the exterior review down here. Give you a little bit of sound there where you can hear it. And I'm gonna slow down roll the windows down, let this guy pass to where he can do his thing, and then I'm going to wind it up for you again and take off from a stop. Now, I'm not flooring it, I'm just giving it some juice, and there's 40, just like that, so right to the speed limit. That's another thing, it's not slow. It's a lot heavier than a normal car of this caliber and such. But this car is in no way slow. This car is quick. And I'm almost back here. Wow, there's going to be United Rentals over here. Huh, cool. Yeehaw, buddy. Another car review down. Check my channel. There's stinking 8,000 videos I have online. I was looking and counting through channels and stuff. And 8,000 videos? That's a lot of videos, dude. It is. Check some of them out. I got other limos and classics and you name it. Now, the real classics. Oh, man, look at this. Here we are. This is like a, a museum. Right when you come in. There you go. You like Lincolns? Lincoln Mark 7 with 26,000 miles. Chevy Astro van. Range Rover 4.6 SH HSE in the P38 edition, man. Got a square body Ford here. Here's a Mercedes limo. Told you I had one. I wasn't lying. I wasn't lying. Okay, I climbed out. Here's your key fob, keychain. Put that in here for now. And I'm going to put the... That light makes a lot of difference if you've been able to see stuff. Door panel, great condition. I threw my paperwork down there. Let me try and... Never even knew to open that. Now I did. Out of pedals. Look at that. Ain't even aware, man. It's in great shape. I don't have a... Um, format in here. A little bit of wear along the edges here. Just discolor a little bit. Um, not wore through and all crappy or nothing. It's in great shape. Headliner's in great shape. All this stuff is all good as it should be. It's all good in the hood. Dash is in good shape. Let me do you these to where you can see. Back, forward, down in the front, up in the front, up in the back. Down in the back, up in the back, recline, unrecline, it's all there. Cup holders, armrest, tags, ashtray and such. Wow, is that on a hydraulic type of a, it did, it kind of shot down to the floor. Books are in there. Um, 
Let me show you in the back here real quick. Whoo, buddy! Door panels, great condition. Look at these seats. They're great. It's a little bit of fold over, I like to call it. It's not really anything. You just get dirt in the little seams. The only thing that even closely resembles a hole is a little pinhole right there. Um, but just in good shape, clean. Got a little things back here. Pull this down. Oh, cool. And this will go through to the back. Velvety. Ooh, that's a nice velvety headliner. Uh, we're going to have to fire this thing up, aren't we? Sure am. Let's just show you the condition of everything. And then let me get up here. Ooh, I wonder. I can. Oh, that's a long ways, buddy. I didn't know. Remember, I put it all the way down there. I'm getting too old for this. Just getting way too old for this. Embarrassing. Pretty tight fit for me, dude. Get stuck in there. Okay. You need lots of liquor if you're gonna have this. Lots of liquor. Well. Wow. Good move up here, don't it? That thing was flipping around. So, I'm trying to get something out of it. Makes me wonder if I should check and not give you the CD. I don't know what that is. What is that? Looks like a DVD player, yes sir. You know, it ain't ejecting that disc. Everybody's MP3 nowadays anyways. Okay, so let's just tell you that we don't think that works. Because I don't want to tell you it does and it don't. Not that. It's got a CD stuck in it. Almost guaranteed. One of those straws. Then you got another one of these little cubby hole things. Over here. Jeez, really? All the way back here. Oh, it goes all the way back. That's why, look at that, rolls all the way back. Bet you this one. No, but it goes all the way back here too, buddy. Trash can? Yes. That would be your trash can. It's got this up here. The window tinting is kind of messed up on that side just a little bit. Um, AC back here, the whole deal, man. Let me get up. Man, I'm just clicking all the wrong things on my phone. I think this is like a saddle strap, yeah. And it comes right off. These move also, nice and heavy. Um, you got your thing there, and this will turn up the fan, and it really goes too, buddy. I'm not kidding, this is the privacy things, and there it goes. Interior lights. Got these. that button bar oh yeah it just hit up lights in the bar oh and it hit up top too little things in here somewhere kind of cool it comes on in stages it does huh I'm clicking them the more it's set, it'll get brighter. Let me close this. There we go. <laughs> That's cool. If you close that. It goes through the dim and the bright of it. I don't even know what that one does. Oh, right there. At the top lights. Uh, 
And that's that, okay. So you've seen that. Now this one is not opening the top. It does have these mirrors and stuff. It seems to work. There you go. We just hadn't been open it so long that they weren't working. Okay, you have seen it all, bud. That's all there is to say about it. You have seen it all. You've seen it in the light, in the dark. You've seen it. Okay, well, that's that. I'm getting out of here, and I'm going to give you an outro and say goodbye. I wanted to say, too, the steering wheel is in pretty good shape. It's just nice with this cushy pad on it. Just a little bit of wear on it. Side airbags and the seats and whatever. It's a safe car. Okay, there's a kicker square sub in the trunk, baby. You got an amp in here somewhere, because it thumpity thumps. Um, you got controls for it and everything down below. He's got some cool stuff in here to keep track of everything. Nice, good sp Wow, I don't know if that's been on the road. But it's in clean, clean shape. That's your trunk. I don't know where I threw this in. I just wanted to throw it in somewhere. And I just sucked down and put a new latch on that thing. Um, and on this side, I'm going to show you this. It's just beautiful. And pull out the books and show you any records I have and such. Um, as a matter of fact, let's do this in the back. All kinds of stuff for all the Clarion and Sony and all your AudioVox, your speakers and all that stuff. You've got all these books. you got your factory books. Everything's in here. But not only that, not only do you have all this cool stuff I'm saying. Hang on one sec. And it's a crystal coach, baby. A crystal coach. That's a heck of a limo. Look at that. Got your actual limousine manufacturer paper. I want to show you this. You got the actual window sticker to the truck. 50 to a car. 15 to 22. And they added a lot more options than that. But that's your deal. Crystal Coach, baby. Any of these other beautiful cars you see, you're like, look, man, we got SL500s and 750ILs and Lantes and Corvettes and you name it. There's all kinds of convertible Mustangs and just all kinds of stuff around here. Old classic pickups you've seen. Over there, we got another limo. And this is your Lincoln Town Car. So thanks for watching. Have a great day or night. Whatever it is, wherever you are, oneownercarguy.com. Check out my channel for all kinds of other videos. And if you're interested in this one, call me up, 406-546-8748. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night. We'll talk to you.